everyone welcome back to my channel or if it's your first time coming across Kirby one of my videos Kirby welcome Kirby to Kirby my Kirby channel Kirby and welcome Kirby to Kirby my brand Kirby new Kirby let's Kirby play Kirby featuring Kirby the Kirby twins Kirby Kirby from my Kirby single Kirby teen Kirby mom Kirby let's Kirby play Kirby which i will Kirby actually leave the link of that playlist down below so you guys can go ahead and check it out if you have not already or if you actually missed that let's play because a lot of the things is going to be very new and you won't really understand if you really if you didn't watch the let's play but i will be um filling you guys in uh, anyone that is new i will be filling you guys in on the sims and you know their family history and all that stuff but we are about to go ahead and get started you guys so look at my twins Delea and Demaya the children of Dwayne and Delilah so as you guys can see right here we are um, living with our father Dwayne and I'm going to explain that to y'all because y'all probably like, what the heck? This is so different. And yes, like, it's it's going to make a lot of sense once I get into it. But um, we got Delay and Maya playing video games right now in their um, father's house. So I did decorate this house myself. And I do want to show y'all, Oh, she became friends with Nayla. Yes, we became friends with our sister. But anyways, I want to show y'all a little bird's side view of the house. It's very, very nice. And I want to thank my boyfriend for helping me with this men's room because I don't know how these, these men be having their rooms and stuff. So he really helped me out on things. And I appreciate him so much. But, um... Yeah, we got the laundry room right here, and then we got the kitchen, the living room. We got um, Delaya's bathroom right here. It is so freaking cute. And we got Demaya's bathroom over here, and we got Delaya's bedroom. It's very pink, very girly, but it's still a teenage room, basically. And then we got my favorite room ever that I've ever done in my whole entire life. And this is Demaya's bedroom. And it's just like, it's just so, like, I don't know. Like, I just, I really went off on this bedroom. Like, you can't even lie. I really did my thing. Like, give me my credits. Thank you. But anyways, they here, I'm um, socializing Shamba, with each other. Target, oh, now he be me. Like, oh, I can't. <laughs> So everyone that is new to this Let's Play, this is your first time coming across this whole Let's Play and the Sims and stuff like that, I will explain a little bit of, you know, the other Let's Play that I did have. Um, so we started off with Delilah, which is Delia and Demaya's mother. So Delia, Delilah is right here, and she is actually a... Um, a graduate, a medical graduate, and she is in the, she has her biology degree, and she is a high school graduate, and, um, she is now into her doctor's field, and if you guys are returning back to this Let's Play and stuff, or you guys watch Single Team Mom, you guys would know, like, how proud we are of Delilah, because she was slacking, like, she for real was slacking, but she finally did it, and now she is a whole graduate, and I am so proud of her, but yeah, so, um, Delilah is her mom, and basically Delilah started off being a 16 year old teenager but she was pregnant with Delia and Demaya the twins right here um and she was basically all alone because Dwayne was a cheating mother freaker okay he was a cheater he still is one but he's stuck in his ways and everything like that um so yeah it, she was basically raising the the twins by herself it was a lot of ups and there was a lot of downs but honestly she did it and she raised these beautiful teenagers but at the end of this of the last let's play it kind of got a little bit hectic because Demaya started rebelling like she she was beating on her mom like she was doing things that she was not supposed to do and that is why that is why um she 
uh, Demaya is with her father right now. And the reason why Delay is, you know, with them as well is because Delay doesn't want to leave her twin sister. Like, they is twin sisters and they are so close and they never want to leave each other's sights. And Delay is kind of influenced by Demaya's actions or by her. You know, like, the way that Demaya moves. Anything Demaya does, Delaya wants to be right there doing it as well. So, I'm sorry that I'm going to be pausing and, and going um, a lot in this first episode. But this is, like, the introduction. And I want to explain a lot to y'all, especially if you are new here. So, yeah. We were um, actually staying with our aunt. Our aunt is right here, Raquel. We were staying with our aunt for a while because we got kicked out of the crib. Um, we were preteens the last time y'all seen them. Um, they got kicked out from just being disobedient. And Demaya would have bad grades. She would abuse her mother, which I did explain before. She snuck out the house, skipped school. And she honestly thought it was a good idea to bring her sister along with her. And like I said before, Delea is always, you know, I'm right with you, sis. You know, I'm right, like, on your heels. We doing everything together. And so she kind of, like, Demaya left a little influence on a bad influence on Delaya, but Delaya is kind of blind by it. She don't think that there's nothing wrong with what her sister is doing and stuff like that. So she's kind of just like the quiet one, but just be peeping things. Like, you know what I'm saying? So, yeah, they were back and forth between their mama house and they aunt Raquel's house. <laughs> Um, and then it was finally, like, time that Del Delilah said, you know what, I can't do this no more. Like, they they just need some more discipline or something because she could not do it no more. So she said it was finally time to just let them go and live with their father because they never lived with their father for a while. They went to go, you know, they went on, you know, little, little um, sleepovers or, you know, they would stay at their father's house for, like, Oh, uh, a weekend or whatever, but he didn't actually live at this crib, y'all. He lived with his um, baby moms, his other baby moms that he cheated on Delilah with. But yeah, y'all should definitely go check out that let's play because it was a lot. But it says only on one condition. Dwayne accepted that his child has a sleepover only if it's at home. He would be less worried to know if they are safe near his. Okay, so she wants to have a sleepover, girl. Girl, come on. <laughs> I'm trying to get into this okay anyways um but yeah so they, he would be staying over over there because he had his little bum era which was like literally the whole let's play he was just a bum and he was literally going back and forth between the late um delilah's um house and his other baby mom's house which is michaela so, Michaela had a child, and her name is um, Haiti, which is our little sister. So, we got, um, basically, we got two sisters because our mom had um, another baby with Dwayne because she was so stuck on Dwayne. Like, she was so stuck on him. Like, it was her baby. It's her baby father. You know, she saw the good in him, and so she had another baby with him, and she thought that it was going to help their relationship, but it just went downhill after that. And, um, yeah, so their little sister is Nayla, which y'all did see that they got closer or whatever. Um, I'll show you guys her. She's a toddler now. Like, look at her little cute face. So, we are definitely going to be playing with Delilah in this Let's Play, y'all. I don't want y'all to think that we are just completely just forgetting, um... Delilah, but we definitely are going to be, you know, going to her household and seeing how she's doing with her career and, you know, see how Nayla grows up and all that fun stuff. We're definitely going to be seeing all of that, you guys, so don't worry. But during all this time, Dwayne really started to, like, feel like he needed to get his ish together. Like, he felt like, you know, it was really time, um... She felt like, well, he felt like it was really time to, you know, be a father and really just be in their kid's life until it's too late and until, like, they just don't care about him and stuff like that anymore. Oh, my God, y'all just gonna leave her by herself? What y'all doing, though? What y'all doing, though? Oh, she about to... Why are you gonna yell at Mr. Wood? She got anger issues. But anyways, so, you know, he decided that he wants to get his ish together. He, you know, he's a successful businessman now. Like, yeah, I'm gonna show y'all his little, um... His little career, whatever. But he is level five in the business career. He's doing really, really well and everything like that. He's a successful businessman. He got his own apartment. You know, he's really been chasing the bag, but he's still stuck in his ways. He's like a... He's like a young boy, but without all the kids. He has four kids. So, oh my God. Why he's insulting her? Stop. 
Let's talk about a cool temperature. Oh, uh, speaking of that, I forgot to put a little thermometer or whatever. But anyways, so yeah, he's trying to grow a better relationship with them, you know, by them moving in with him and everything like that. He's currently 30 years old now. Him and Delilah are the same age. So they is um about to be adults. Like, they about to be adult adults. I'm saying, like, adults are, like, 40 to 50 years old. And then 20 to uh, 30 is, like, the young adult. So, yeah, they're 30 years old, you know. They're honestly getting their life together. And, Nail, uh, not Nayla, sorry, Delilah and Demaya really just in their teen years. They're about to start their first day of high school tomorrow. So, I need to actually have them get ready for that day. But he's all sad because of his jealous ways with his his little H-O-E of a, a girl toy, if that makes sense. I'm going to explain. There's a lot to explain, you guys. Oh, my God. Like, this Let's Play is just all, like, it's not all the place, but it's, like, it's going to be so much fun. Like, she wants to tease her sister. I'm going to let her do it because she's been a little rebel herself. But I want to show you guys their outfits as well. But anyways, you guys. And I need to also get into their relationships with everyone. Like, look at how everyone grown up. Megan, Atlas, Carmen, Maya, I mean, Mia, like, this is a lot, but, um, so, yeah, they don't really have a great relationship, um, Demaya, her mom, they really just, they actually, because I remember when they were younger, she had a better relationship with them, but now, like, she just started abusing her mom, she'd been saying disgusting things to her mom, and just things weren't going too well, for real. So, Delaya finally got the boy, y'all, Carmen, y'all remember Carmen? From single team mom, yes, she finally got the boy. Her and Carmen have been flirting for a bit now. They honestly not into anything serious, nothing like that. But they've been, you know, <laughs> a little, a little whatever, you know, some, some slight or whatever. Um, Delay and Megan started getting really, really close. Um, that's honestly like her, you know, her, her good friend type ish. But Megan be having her little H O E times. And Delia is kind of, like, loyal. Like, she's loyal to Carmen, which could honestly backfire on her because I feel like Carmen is, like, that, like, he's, like, he's honestly him. Like, he honestly don't, I don't really see him really settling down because he's so young. So, yeah. And then Jakari and Delia, um, they started getting really, really close, as you can see. Her and Jakari have a really great relationship. Like, this is literally her best friend, like, um... They really started, like, talking about life and talk about their goals and family. And he's always just been there for her through everything, like, through thick and thin for real. And so they're really good friends now. Um, her and Atlas, y'all know that <laughs> Delay and Atlas were supposed to be together, but that didn't end up being too good because they would always just not be on the same page. And so she don't really like Atlas for real. And then Mia, you know, she don't really like Mia because her sister don't like Mia, <laughs> so she don't like Mia. But, um, yeah, then Robin, she kind of is, like, this shy, intimate girl, but she's, like, a, she acts innocent, but she really be on her rebel-ish as well. Like, she be smoking weed, she be on her rebel-ish as well. I feel like her and Demaya would really click really, really well. Um, but yeah, they have, like, the same friend group, but I feel like Delia gets jealous of her sister because she thinks that her sister's, like, the perfect one, like, her sister always gets along with everybody and stuff like that, but she is really close, um, Demaya is really close with Atlas, like, they have such a funny and goofy relationship together, and that is, that is her, her Siga, okay, that is her Siga, not her Siga as in a romantic way, but, like, that is her Siga as in, like, you know, that's my bro type is, you know, so that's her and Atlas, Carmen, she honestly has a good, great relationship with Carmen, because they always had a good relationship, um, and, you know, they did a little flirts here and there and everything like that, but it's never been, like, too, too serious, um, Mia, you know, y'all, she don't like her. Megan, she don't really care for Megan, for real. And Robin, she don't really care. Jakari, they, whatever. Like, it's like kind of everyone is just there, but she does have a better relationship with some people. And, yeah, so, um, we have, we're good friends. Her first sentiments about Atlas is that he's immature, but she loves how immature he is. But just look at Atlas, okay, period. So I'm going to get into, like, everyone's, like, um, 
like they friends and everything like that so atlas is like this chubby kid that always got bullied like he always got bullied his whole life but was always the one that put a smile on everyone's face like he just wants to find someone that's like him like that's always like goofy and just happy and someone that just loves him for him but he's i love atlas like i feel like he's my favorite out of all the friends because he's just so goofy and just so like funny like he don't even try to be funny but he just funny <laughs> so that is um um atlas and then when it comes to carmen i told y'all like he really just that sigla um he thinks that well, we think that he's immature, and um, his first impression of us is that we're br brutally honest, which that is very true. Uh, she still thinks that he's very attractive, so yeah. Um, not really too much about Carmen, honestly. He's just there. Like, I, I see him being, like, a football player, but, um, yeah, he kind of just does his own thing. I want to see, wait, what does she think about? Okay, she doesn't have, like, no romantic thing, because that's really her, her, yeah. And then Jakari here, um, we both think he, we, each other, they both think that they're, f each other is funny. Um, Jakari's just like a basketball player and he's also like a player when it comes to girls as well. He doesn't owe any of these HOEs, no loyalty. He really just in his own lane and he's trying to pursue his basketball career. Um, and then Mia, honestly, everyone used to just be so mean to her, like, literally so mean to her, um, for no reason, I literally don't even know why, but, um, she always got made fun of when she was younger, and nobody wanted to be her friend, so now she's, like, in her bossed-up era, and now she don't need these, she don't need these girls, okay, period, um, and then Megan, she's honestly, um, just, like, wants to be, like, the popular girl, you know, her and Delaya definitely have something in common, and she is low-key a Trisha, Dirty Diana. Go get a breath mint before you come get a session. I told y'all, she's like a fake good girl. She be smoking weed. She's like a stoner, a stoner nerd, but she just be quiet and just, yeah. She don't really like Dem um, Demaya because um, she thinks that she rude. And then Demaya thinks that she's pretentious. <laughs> So this seems to be rather possessive. So yeah, they don't really, do, they really like, um, they don't really like each other for real. Um, but yeah, that's basically all of the friends. I do want to see what she thinks about the rest of them. Um, she thinks that Robin is stuck up and she definitely is. Oh, she thinks that we're independent and capable. That's kind of cute. I like that. And then let me see Megan real quick. <laughs> she thinks that she is annoying. Delaya thinks that she's annoying, but she loves her. Um, in Dreamland. Okay. But anyways, y'all, that's like basically everybody. Oh, let me see about Carmen. Sorry. <laughs> Carmen and everyone. Okay, so yeah. Anyways. <laughs> So, yeah, I'm going to explain some more stuff as well, but I'm going to do that while they get ready, y'all. But there is still a lot of other sims that you probably are seeing in this um, relationship panel and everything like that. But we about to get started to um, get ready to, um, you know, to go to school and everything like that. So, we about to go and apply our facial cleanser. And uh, I'm going to actually have Delaya come over here. She's going to take her shower and apply her facial cleanser. Um, She is a little bit hungry. Maybe they will order some pizza because it's like a late night, late night type of vibe. So we're going to use this as well. I'm going to get some, um, we need to get some pads, tampons. And then we also need to get some facial stuff, which we will do that a little later on. But we're going to brush our teeth after this. Oh, wait, no, they're going to order some pizza, so we're not going to do that. Hold on, there's too much going on. Um, don't wait, what do you really want to speak to me about? Like, for real. What do you, what do, what would you like? Like, <laughs> what would you like? <laughs> but, um... Yeah, we're going to use the bathroom. And I'm going to actually have probably Demaya go ahead and order some pizza. Okay, we're going to get um, some of this. Let's get some sweet and sour pork. And Mapo Tofu. No, no, no. We're going to get 
some get something for our dad too. Um, but yeah, we are gonna order that food and stuff, and she about to be mischievous with her father. Okay. Anyways, let's go. Um, brush. Our, no, not the brush our teeth. So they're just gonna wait a little bit, I guess. Can we actually use this? Yes, we can. Okay, we're gonna change into our sleepwear outfits. And you as well, you're gonna change your outfit. Um, and this is our little pet dog. This is our pet hamster. So which we need a name for our pet hamster. So y'all let me know something. <laughs> Some names down below and everything. But yeah, they hungry as hell. And we just waiting for the food. Whose homework is this right here? Okay, it's not yours, so it must be yours. All right, I'm about to have her go and play some Overwatch. And my girl here, she about to go and write in her journal. Oh, write a steamy love letter. No, go and write a journal. <laughs> um, So, oh, here's our food. Wait, here's our food right here. Okay, come on. We gonna um, go and purchase, get our food. Come over here, girl. Accept our delivery. We got the noisy neighbors that we do not appreciate at all. But we still gon' yeah, do our thing. Thank you so much for my food. I appreciate it. Okay, put this in our inventory. Alright. And then we gonna um, take this out and open this delivery. Oh, yeah, we also have Whiskers, Mr. Whiskers as well. I don't know where he at, but we have a little cat, y'all. Um, all right, so we're going to have our two. Girl, now, where the hell did the. Now, girl, why did they give me some empty plates? You serious? They gave me an empty plate? <laughs> Because why they do us like that? Like, why they really do us like that? For real. That sucks. Like, why would they do us like that? Alright, we making our stuff. Okay, so he got this girl, Keisha. I love Keisha so much. This is Keisha. Um, his little, his little girlfriend or whatever. He literally told her that um, she's his favorite. He thinks she's very attractive. She is so pretty. And then we got this H-O-E. Okay, Jessica, and um, he she is very attractive to him, and they got drift in love. That's why he been acting all sad and stuff, because he's trying to fall in love with Jessica when Jessica be falling in love with every single man that has money. So, they don't really have a good relationship and stuff like that, but they're going to be working on it. But he she's really like a booty call, and y'all going to see her botched body. Like, her body is looking like Asian doll, okay? I'm just saying. <laughs> No shade, no shade. But um, yeah, that's Jessica, and then they got he got Michaela, or whatever. And Michaela's like his wifey, like that's the wifey that you like cuff after all the, all the the play player times and stuff. That's the girl that he you cuff or whatever. So yeah. And Keisha and Demaya actually have a really good relationship. As you can see, Keisha's always coming over to the house, checking up on the girls, you know, being like a, a mother figure, like a stepmother figure to them and stuff like that. Um, and they really have like a goofy, friendly relationship. And Keisha's honestly been like the nice girlfriend as well. And Demaya sometimes feels bad because Keisha not the only girl that her, her dad is really messing with. So she does be feeling bad and stuff like that. But, you know, it's not really her business for real. So he's going to grab something to eat. Okay, go and grab something to eat. And then we going to actually have our sister grab something to eat as well when she's done. Um, but yeah, she be feeling bad and stuff like that. And then Jessica be low-key hating on Delaya for no reason. Like, she really just be hating on her, like, for whatever reason. But, um, she mad. And also, Delaya been, um, sneaking in some, some drinks, y'all. She been drinking low-key. And I got a screenshot of her drinking. I will put it up right here. But, um, her dad caught her drinking. He got so furious with her. 
So they're not really on good terms right now, but yeah. So that's basically that. Like they just been, it's just been a hell of a ride, y'all. I want to make sure I'm not missing nobody for real. But if I am missing anything, I will fill you guys up. But Delaya wants to actually start her own little clothing brand. Um, and she kind of wanted to get into like social media and when like the cheerleading stuff opens up She wants to definitely try out for that um, And Demaya really is just wants to be a successful streamer like a video game streamer and stuff like that She loves video games and that's the type of Route she wants to go when it comes to her profession. Obviously, she's gonna try different things, but that's basically that you know, she still got, they both still got beef for all the friends because they didn't come to their birthday party. Okay, y'all remember that? They didn't come to their birthday party, so there's still a little bit of tension, but they love their friends for real. Um, and Delaya loves to write in her journal as well because she likes to write down, like, goals and stuff. Girl, this is not your freaking bed. If you, um, tired, go in your bed. Oh, wait, actually, no, go brush your teeth first, and then you can go to sleep. Um, but yeah, so she likes to write in her journal, whatever. We go um brush our teeth too and then head to bed. Um so I do wanna get to their career stuff or whatever uh situated soon. So we're gonna do that. He napping right now, but um I'm gonna put on the auto lights or just like turn off this room right here. Wait. Gonna be for real. Turn off this room. Oh, pet fears. What are you? What are you fearful of? Absolutely nothing. Um. But I think I really covered everything, y'all. It's just a lot going on, and I'm really excited for this. Let's play. Like it's gonna be so much freaking fun. So, the delay is gonna wake up right now because she is so excited for school. She is so, so, so excited for school. She gonna wake up and she gonna go ahead, brush her teeth, take her a little, uh, a little soaks. Girl, what the hell? A little, um, <laughs> rose petal soaks and stuff. My girl, look at her all ready for school. Well, she getting ready for school. They also do plan on going to see the, the uh, their friends and everything later on after school. Um, and then when they wake up, I do want to get them going with the other stuff. Okay, you need to wake up for um, work too. Come on now. Get your way up with his luxurious bathroom. You're going to brush our teeth. Okay, take us a shower. Quick little shower. And I know he gonna invite over his little, you know, it's like the first day of school. We gotta like, we gotta pop out type ish. So we gonna wear this one. <laughs> yeah, we gonna do our little. So this is the Utra. This is the Utra, y'all, of the day. She doing her little um eyeliner. Mm-hmm. <laughs> and they both got braces, y'all. They both got a gap. It's so cute. <laughs> it's so cute. She really gonna make up at like seven. Because she really don't care about no damn school. Okay, so he done getting out the shower. Did you brush your teeth? Okay, then he definitely did. I mean, he was just walking around in the towel for now, I guess. He gonna call up um, Jessica and try and chat with her a little bit. <laughs> this is my first time. Oh, she's sleeping. This is my first time really, you know, playing with a, a guy and not making him like a I mean, well, he still is a cheater, but, like, you know how I usually do, like, single teen mom, but, like, they is a girl, so now it's kind of like a single dad uh, point of view. Yeah, fill out reports. Okay, there we go. So, he gonna do that. She finished her makeup. <laughs> Let's pretend that she actually yeah, looks uh pretty good. Let's get up here. We gonna see our, our little hamster. And then we gonna go over here and brush our teeth. Sure yeah, go ahead and feed this little sh No, let me stop. <laughs> let me stop going. <laughs> she really be, um, what's it called? She be trying to steal her, her sister's makeup, like her little blush. As you can see, she got like a little blush on it. She be trying to steal her, her sister makeup because she's not, she not gonna get no um, makeup or nothing like that. Does she need to shower? I don't even know. Let's go and take us a quick shower. And then... She gonna wear something 
this school we probably gonna wear it like this what is she doing oh she going to do homework in her sister room whatever floats your boat girl okay he's still filling out reports and oh. stuff he probably gonna get him a, a little drink real quick <laughs> Let's do a classic old fashioned. Okay, what did he want to do? Oh, he wants to kiss someone. What is freaky? Okay, my girl is done and getting ready. Where's she at? Okay. We're going to play with our little uh, thing right here. Yep, she wearing this to school, y'all. <laughs> she do not care. Like, it's the first day of school. She do not care, bro. They're gonna go to school um alone and everything because I haven't really prepared. I forgot that we can actually go to school with them. So in the next episode, we'll see a little day in the life of them going to school. But I have to set that all up. They about to go to school and Dwayne needs to go as well. But he's still filling out reports. Oh. Honestly, he really does don't even be caring. Let me go get a drink real quick before we leave. Come on. All right, we gonna give some love with um we gonna pet. Go and pet, um, okay. I'm so sorry, Mr. Whiskers, but I'm gonna, um, come back to y'all once they are back from school and work. So we got an unknown call while we at school. Hey, mind if I crash at your place for a few days? Who the hell is? No, you cannot. No. Um, and I do want to let you guys know on Delia, um, her little status at school. Um, she's been studying hard and everything. So it says, Delaya focuses hard and reviews all of the material and it pays off big time. She scores higher on the test than anyone else in the class. The teacher congratulates her on a job well done. So she got a performance level game. We love it. So I'm about to just wait for them to come back. Delilah is calling to chat. Why are we at school, mom? Like, come on, eh? Can we just get all? Oh my God, Jessica! Question: Remy and I were planning to do some casual friend time together. If I were you, I wouldn't do that because he is jealous. He don't want his hair to. Okay, the thing is with Dwayne is that he knows that she is a H O E, but he doesn't. He wants her to be to himself. Like he's selfish, but like you can't be. You can't be selfish with a H O E. Like they're gonna do whatever they want regardless. <laughs> Like, let's be for real, but the girls is back home, yes. And you know what Delance wants to do? She wants to, I'm very friend, much happy, wow. Um, wait, girl, what the hell? Girl, what did you <laughs> No, because when did she smoke? No, 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 no. When did she smoke? Oh my god, Demaya has a project that she's not gonna do. <laughs> okay, um, so they got projects or whatever. I think that Delaya gonna start, um, you know, working on her project. But before we do that, we gonna, um, take us a little, a little quick nap. Okay, let's go and say hi to, um, uh, uh, he wake, um, sleep, so let's just go take a little nap real quick. My girl here, she wants to get her some weed. So we gonna see, um... I mean, we can't really get nothing right now. Like, you be acting like you can't power nap over here. Okay, so the period tracker, she is, wait, currently you're at not day nine of your cycle out of ten days. Next period starts in one day. Okay, yeah, so we need definitely need to go to the period, um, to the store and get some. Um, some pads and whatnot, because they about to set their period, so we about to go over there. Girl, is you going to go? Damn. Alright, so we just going to get some pad boxes, because I don't know about y'all, but when I was, and still, to this day, I do not do tampons. I'm not doing that. Like, I can't. It's so uncomfortable, so I'm going to, um, just get two pad boxes for them, and... That should be good. I'm not going to let them get anything else. <laughs> she had a long day at school, y'all. She just wants some peace and quiet. I need to get the thing for the cat. Y'all, I'm hella slow. I was supposed to put this on it. <laughs> okay, but anyways, we going to fill this bowl and call Mr. Whiskers to eat. 
But she's taking her little power nap. And I'm gonna go to this little hangout thing as well. So we're not gonna be working on this little project for too long. All right, come on now. Oh, let me turn the lights. <laughs> Oops, I totally forgot to turn on these lights. And then we gonna um, change our little outfit into something a little bit more subtle. I mean, we could just put back on our sleepwear outfit just for now. I wanna give them some like house clothes, like just something that they change into from school. And they really do, so I'm gonna definitely do that. But we're gonna work on this carefully. What does she wanna do? She wants to chat with her sister. Okay. Well, we're about to go to the hangout thing. I don't even know if she wants to stay what? here. If she wants to, <laughs> she said <so> hi. <laughs> Yo, I don't know where she got the weed from. Like, where? Who even did this? Let me give you one of these. Like, who even? And why do you got the vacuum? She's like, girl, can you stop like doing this school project? Like, it's no. We don't want to do this project. Okay, but I do want to um get them started on their little social media. I don't know if I want to get them actually like a whole job. Because I don't want that to be stressing them out. Like, you know? Like, I don't know. I feel like they just want to do it for fun for now. And then after... Oh, she's going to take a little power nap. Then after, then they do... They, um... You know, get their little job and stuff. Um... But I'm going to actually have her stop doing this. Oh, he home. Okay. Well, we're going to stop doing this. We're going to change back into our little clothes. Because we didn't take a shower. So we might as well go back into our outfit. And then after she's done her power now, we're about to go out, you guys. See the friends and everything. Yo, everyone is taking a power nap. I'm freaking crying. He's feeling bitter. Okay, well, too freaking bad. All right, so is she ready? Okay, yeah. We're about to leave, y'all. We're about to go hang out with our friends. All right, so we're here with the crew of what I'm What's good, everyone? Girl, like, we don't need this energy. Like, you can leave. We don't need it. No, I'm just <laughs> Anyways, we about to be like, oh, my God. Hi, Carmen. <laughs> we going to do a little physical. Oh, my God. No. Go and give him a little hug. And then we going to, um. <laughs> Ugh, yuck. <laughs> Okay. Wrong. Okay. Switch, see, Garza. like, what Tom. is that? Sim is inch um irresistible. Delay has a major crush on Carmen. Why is he being mean to me though? Oh, cause he's just a mean ass person. Okay, cute. But anyways, this is a little like um teen hangout place that they really gonna be at like all the time. Okay, like all the time. She about to get a drink, is she? She about to order some food. But yeah, they are gonna be over here all the time, y'all. Can they actually? No, they can't. Okay, they can, um, I'm gonna actually have her watch, um, the end games with Atlas. I mean, Jakari can join us, too. We didn't bring Mia or, um, Robin, because we don't really care to, yeah. <laughs> Anyways, they here talking and everything, like, oh, what? By the way, they never, like, had any, um, woohoo yet, y'all, by the way. So, she is a V-card. And I don't know if... <laughs> I don't know. I'll we'll have to see what happens. But they kind of just hitting it off right now. Ah, Rainbow here. All right, they watching. <laughs> Look at Atlas. Look at his shirt with his whole... <laughs> the whole his shirt. Bad bitch, love me, uh, yeah, okay, period. Anyways, we about to just be funny with him, tell him a little joke, a little inside joke. Oh, you didn't order your food? Did she take our food? This little. Let's go order us, um, a corn dog. Oh my god, it's zero Samoans, we love it here. Yeah, We love it here. Let's be funny, silly behavior. 
But I love Demaya and Atlas's like relationship. Like they just so perfect. What you doing? Must comment his appearance. You haven't even said hi to your your best friend yet. Who the hell is is um is crying? <laughs> Her high. Oh my god. <laughs> Cannabis induced giggles, laughing uncontrollably. <laughs> I'm smoking weed. <laughs> oh my goodness. Girl, go and get you some food. Go get you some food, please. The, it's in use. Girl, I don't care. We don't take this drink. Oh, man. So they really about to stay out here late, though. We can't even eat no food because all she doing is making drinks. Like, girl, I want some food. Corn dog. Can I please get a corn dog? I need a corn dog. Is this Michaela? Oh, my God. Michaela just coming out from work, it looks like. <laughs> Anyways, so we gonna get us. Oh my god, it's so busy. Like y'all not even teens and y'all here. Leave. Oh my goodness. Go eat your corn dog. Are you hungry, girl? Yeah, go eat your slider and take this drink too. <laughs> take this drink. Look, she has to sit down with her, with her little boy telling her little boyfriend is. Girl, nobody want to sit with you. Move. Girl, eat your food right here. Silly, silly. They all just a mess. Oh, she about to go to somewhere else. Like, I'll come and eat your food. Oh my. <sighs> now we're gonna have to be disrespectful. You hear me? Rude introduction. You eating my food. I ain't playing with you. Now you eating my food. She's about to do something. Uh, nah, boy, be for real. Like, why would you do that? Yeah, we don't call you a smidge. Okay, yeah, because you're being very much a smidge. Oh, she's happy because she had a satisfying day at school. And Carmen really just going to be doing some push-ups. Oh, nah. I feel like Demaya gonna step up and be like, mm, what's going on here? She's talking to Michaela down here. I'm freaking crying. No, actually, that's a, that's a delay of um, type problem. Um, we gonna sit next to our best friend. <laughs> and we gonna be funny with him. <laughs> Anyways, yeah, I'm gonna actually have them just chill over here for a little bit longer. We're gonna see what Dwayne is doing back at home. Alright, y'all, yeah, so Dwayne here on the toilet, and he just invited over Jessica, and she should be here. I think this is her right here, but she literally invisible. Jessica, I can't see you. Y'all, look at Jessica. <laughs> yes, Jessica, baby. <laughs> Nobody, but like her doctor did his so freaking terrible. But Dwayne really attracted to this girl. Like he just be asking her to come over for like a little, a little fun time for real. They about to go and take some shots together. It looks <laughs> like um we gonna see how that goes or whatever. But he is very energetic. 
from asking her to take some shots. So we about to go over here and serve some drinks. We're going to do a little um, champagne rosé. He knows that she is, like, very bougie and stuff like that. Oh, my God. From talking to an attractive sin. Why must the wings? <laughs> I don't know what I was about to say, but. Girl, if you don't come inside, like, hello. Come on in. She be acting all shy and stuff. But yeah, let's go and grab a drink with Jessica. Even though this is not a shot, but it's okay. We gonna take a little a little drink with her. Yo, you, you wanna just go straight to it, huh? No, come on, let's let's ease our way into this. <laughs> oh my god, where'd she go? Oh, oh does she like cats? Okay, that's cute. Anyways, we gonna chat with her. Can I like apologize? Cause she probably not gonna go for nothing right now. We gonna tell her that um she's his favorite. <laughs> yeah, I cannot stop looking at her legs. <laughs> Oh my goodness. <laughs> Snurs with Bumpa. But we gonna tell her. Bon and Gravy? Oh, yeah. See, it's working. A successful day at the office. Ooh, it's definitely Bonner. working, y'all. Ah. We gonna comment her appearance a little bit. Let's Jonah see. Awkward encounter. Caught the love of his life flirting with another. Are they joking around or just yeah. losing interest? How do I tell you? Oh, yes. <laughs> How do I tell you? She all up on her phone. See, this is why he got trust issues in these oh. emails. Because they be taking on their phone every single time. Um, you know she be flirting down. Stressful day at work. Of course, y'all got a stressful day at work. I mean, it kind of is what it's given. Be just, girl, boy, if you don't stop, because she not doing nothing. And you just, you just having your little, your little session or whatever. Like, relax. She accepted it anyway. So, I mean, they have developed a romanceless romantic agreement, y'all. Should we ask her? About her body count? No, let's not do that. We gon' offer the woohoo in bed. <laughs> just like they. Booty call! Booty call! Oh, booty call! No. We just got. It takes you this long <laughs> to drink this little yeah. champagne? Uh -uh. Oh my gosh, she said, uh uh. Mm -mm, uh, -uh. uh Why though? Uh, Y'all so annoying. Man. Like, how you gonna offer to be friends with benefits and you don't even wanna be the benefit? Oh, they back home? Oh, shit. You know what? She playing hard to get. Honestly, I need some coochie, so get out. We sending her home. She having her little fit. Anyways, the girls are back home and stuff. They about to get ready for bed. We're going to brush our teeth. Where's our hamster? Let's go and play with our hamster a little bit. Delaya is mad freaking tired. She about to go and brush her teeth, apply her facial cleanser, and go right to sleep. Are you for real wasted? I am so mad right now. Oh, nah. He caught her. Very embarrassed. Le Delia is very embarrassed after being caught by her parents doing drugs. Oh, my God. She did not hide her eyes. <laughs> I freaking cry it. Okay, we're going to apply this facial cleanser, too. He about to go and have a quick meal. How about you go and make some? He about to make some food. Y'all, I just realized that we didn't have a fridge this whole time. Like, my slow... Yeah, I'm I'm slow. Yeah, we're gonna play with our little hamster. Oh, Probably gonna bite us in our nose. Uh -huh. Damn, we're gonna got your lips all up in the hamster. Uh -huh. Hell not, <laughs> twin. Please do not lose this hamster. She not even gonna take a shower after after school. She just going straight into her sleep outfit. Alright, we're gonna sit down here and try and play some damn overwatch. Please. Okay, there we go. 
My sister is sleeping. He making some dinner, you guys. Yes, I also got this little painting thing because I want her to be like a little artist. Like, she'll like, oh my god. <laughs> I didn't even know that she actually has a little relationship. But I want her to like do some art stuff. Maybe even like digital painting. We can get her like a digital tablet and do that. I want to see if she can actually just start streaming even on her own. I don't really think we could. I want to show y'all the outfits. And then we're going to end the episode. Alright, you guys. So, you guys did see Demaya's sleepwear outfits. But, this is it. And then, um, her everyday outfits. One. And then, this is two. Then, we got three, four, and five. Very cute. I don't know why it's bugged oh. out like this. Because it wasn't like this before. But, I might have to change her skirt. Y'all. Anyways, and then Delaya, my girl Delaya. Y'all seen her sleep outfit. I'm gonna add some like house clothes outfits. But this is her first every day. Then we got her second, her third. Oh, I love this outfit. And then we got her fourth, and then her fifth outfit. So that is Miss Delaya. Look at the braces. Oh, my girl is so freaking pretty. Wait, hold on. I need to do a close-up on Demaya, too. But Demaya really be using her sister's makeup to do, like, the little blush and whatnot. But, yeah, this is Demaya. Look at my girls. Like, they're getting so freaking big. I'm so sad because we really seen them when they were just in the womb, like. When they're in the womb and we really watch them grow up and everything. But this is Dwayne's outfits. Um, very chill, honestly. He's just a chill, laid back singer. You know? He got the Glocky on Okay, he don't play with his kids. Alright, so yeah, that's them, yeah. Alright, you guys. I'm gonna go ahead and end this episode right here. I hope you guys all enjoyed. If you did, don't forget to give this video a big thumbs up. And don't forget to subscribe to the channel if you have not already. And turn that bell so you get notified every single time I upload a brand new video. I love y'all so, so, so much. And I'll talk to you guys in my very next one. Bye. Yes.